the PNP-HPG or Philippine National Police Highway Patrol Group recently marked its 60th founding anniversary and we have with us this week Police Superintendent Elizabeth Velasquez to give us briefly some of the highlights of the momentous event. Good afternoon Officer Velasquez and welcome once again to Motoring Today. Yes, good afternoon Boots and thank you for inviting us again. So can you briefly appraise us as to how the celebrations of the HPG's 60th founding anniversary went? Well, uh, the Highway Patrol Group has celebrated its 60th uh, anniversary. Uh, this is a three-day celebration that started on May 4 to May 6. It started with the Thanksgiving Mass and after we had a rattling ceremony uh, with, with, the, with our uh, with the PNP Heroes Monument, no, we are we, we do this to honor the, our dead comrades who died in line of duty, and then it was followed by a blessing of a three-story building. We call it HPG training uh, uh, building. Uh, this will cater the uh, training of uh, and seminars of uh, our organic uh, highway patrol group personnel. And afterwards is our anniversary proper. Uh, which we uh, honor all the outstanding and deserving uh, HPG personnel who have individually and collectively has uh, contributed to the accomplishments of the mission and uh, objectives of the Highway Patrol Group. In the 60 years of existence of the PNP HPG, can you cite to us the highlights of its glorious achievements during its six decades of service to the nation, particularly in the fields of anti-car napping, hijacking, and highway robbery. Well, Boots, uh, guided by our Oplan uh, Lambat Sibat, for the last year, we have recovered at least uh, 505 motor vehicles, comprised of 362 motor vehicles and 223 motorcycles. We have also neutralized two car napping groups no, and arrested 329 suspects. Uh, Three armed uh, car thieves were killed in six separate uh, encounters. We ha have already filed 119 uh, cases in court, uh, served 65 warrants uh, and seven search warrants. And of course, we, re we have recovered at least uh, 311 firearms and uh, some of them are, are high powered. Of course, we have also conducted several training and seminars on road safety and, and especially on anti-car napping uh, to the local and other private uh, units. This is intended for them to uh, for them to be uh, aware of how to not to be victimized by uh, crime of car napping. We have now the one-stop shop. Uh, where the the applicants will be able to stream we, we are streamlining our clearance uh, procedure that's why we have installed a one-stop shop just just like in a Jollibee or uh, in uh, McDonald's where we're in the uh, applicants will let uh, a light from the vehicle we're also strengthening our counterintelligence operations against uh, personalities to, to include the PNP personnel that are reported to be involved in the crime of car napping. So uh, our operations are intelligence and people driven, meaning uh, we concentrate on intelligence and we are running after these uh, car nappers. Can you also please tell our viewers of the PNP HPG's present measures and plans that are in the pipeline to further improve its mandated duties and services? Through our clearance system, we are now uh, checking or we have a record check for second-hand uh, vehicles being applied to our clearance divisions. We have also intensified our uh, operations on the distribution of flyers on anti-car napping tips and road safety. Of course, we have also uh, an ugnayan to the barangay for their awareness on our campaign against car napping, hijacking, and highway robbery. Uh, Actually, uh, last May 12, uh, our uh, officer in charge, Police Senior Superintendent Arnold uh, Gunacao, together with other uh, with other officers, have attended a Senate uh, hearing committee. No, we are we are into recommending for the crime of car napping to be a non-bailable crime, because of, as of now, based on Republic Act 6539. 
uh, the crime of carnapping is available. So we would like to recommend and uh, possi possible passage of the bill for uh, making the crime of carnapping an unavailable crime. Thank you, Superintendent Velasquez, for sharing with us your time by being a guest here on Motoring Today. Thank you, Boots. Thank you, ma'am. Highway Patrol Group Spokesperson, Superintendent Elizabeth Velasquez, our guest this week on Motoring Today's Motoring Forum.